Nice. Dude, let's go. Oh my goodness. What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Untamed Outdoorsman. And today we have a little bit different of an unboxing style today. Uh, the other day was actually Pete's birthday. We are going to be unboxing something that I will not be saying out loud. Uh, you guys will already know what it is by the title. But we're going to be unboxing that item. And Pete has no idea what this is. Pete's going to unbox this thing and um, should be a fun surprise. I think it'll I think it'll go really well with another item. So, uh, okay. Yeah. All right. So, am I ready? Do I yeah, get... I should probably brought a knife with me. Or no, <laughs> do you want, you want to just open it right up? Yeah, that's right. Dude, is this what I think it is? I don't know. This is definitely what I think it is. I think I sent you this on Instagram. <laughs> Dude, that's sick. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, that's so cool. So Track that's the, pack. Yeah. This is the new one they just released, right? Yep. We released it like a week ago. Dude, this is insane. We're gonna need a knife. Yes, we are. So. Apparently these have like a golden ticket in them too, possibly. Oh really? Yeah. And they have not, apparently from the time that we're recording this, it hasn't been found yet. So there's like, I think there's three out there. It's a $100, $200, $300 value. So you find one of those. I might get lucky. Yeah, you might get really lucky. Okay. Golden ticket. <laughs> Dude, this is sick. Awesome, right? What is that? Just um, a piece of paper? Yeah, just a piece of paper. I was just like, oh no. Paper. <laughs> oh, I think this is for labels. Yeah, it is yeah. for labels. I think yeah. you can label like right over here. So yeah. yeah. Okay, number two? Nothing. 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 So this one, okay. was, this one didn't have it. This but. one didn't. But this is still sick. This is awesome, right? This is still so, awesome. Two stickers, too. A yellow one and a black one. But... Yeah, I think you can just take them right out too. You yeah, should be able to pop them right out. Um, I think so. Yeah, 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 right there on the other side. Yeah, there you go. Oh, dude. That's nuts. So you can have two on either yeah. side of the kayak if you want. Yeah, I, th I think there's one base. Like, like yeah, there is yeah, one. Yeah, it only comes with one base that you can remove too. <coughs> I, I haven't looked at this. Yeah, so the base goes on. That's the base. And then, that's all the mounting. Yeah, it's all the mounting hardware here. But I, I was thinking that this would go great because you have a lot longer tracks on your boat. Yeah. So especially in front of that fish farm, you got a ton of space. I got so much room that I just don't utilize it. Right. So now you'll have a spot for all your stuff, whatever you want to load it so up. So what with. is this one for? Is this for? Like, oh, that's just I think if you're hanging it. Oh, okay. That's what I, was I think you can just cut that right off. I would say it comes out anyway. But yeah, it does. Yeah. So. Well, it says yak attack on it, so maybe. You know what this would be good for? If you take it off the boat at the end of the year and put it on a peg. Yeah, you just hang it right up. I'll just leave that on. Yeah. I would do that. But I think I think you can choose how you want to orient it. So you can put one here, and then you can like have it further facing or further away facing from the track. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or you can put them in like this and have them more right secure. The I, I'd probably do it that way. Just keep them more secure. Yeah, probably. You can transport with them and stuff and just tighten this Joe Schmo down. Dude, that's sick. I know, right? Thing is sweet. I mean, that was a perfect. I, I literally thought about it because it was releasing like on your birthday, and I was like, "This yeah. is genius." You know what this is good for? For me, is my tools. Yeah. Because I never ever have anywhere to put my tools. Oh, well, there you go. So I can put them right in here and just close it up, lock the lid, and I'm good to go. So I'm trying to find out what the screws do. What do the screws do? Mm. I'm not sure. May I? It, it, it might be to actually like, drill in. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 I think it's the drill right in. Yeah, right if, if you want, I, I wouldn't do that. No, I get the rails that are perfect. Yeah, exactly. So but, but this thing is sweet. This thing is like Dude, this is sick. storage, storage upgrades. Oh, yeah, and then you put the labels right here. Yeah, and no. I think you can actually buy another one of these mounts for like 10 bucks. So if you, wanted, probably, if you wanted one on each side, you can too. Yeah. yeah. I, this is going to be a lifesaver when I go to, like, because I can fit. Oh, yeah, it easily fit yeah. in pliers. And yeah. Everything. yeah. You can use it for storage, soft plastics, you name it. So, yeah, I could. Well, I could use one for like my pli. I'll probably keep my pliers one on the top, and then I'll keep. 
I'm not sure what I'll keep down bottom yet. I haven't decided. Yeah. But it's cool too because you can keep them on while you transport the boat too because they they actually latch in. Yeah. And then plus it'll be further up the kayak so it won't get messed up. Dude, that's sick. Uh, no. Thank you. No problem. Absolutely. That's gonna be that's gonna be a lifesaver, dude. It, it, it was a no brainer. I was like, this this is genius. Because yeah. I know how much I fumble for my pliers and everything else while I'm on the boat. Oh yeah. So it'll be nice. I can just put them right to my side of me, and then <laughs> it'll be yeah. perfect. Genius. And then you got the stickers here too. You can do whatever you want with these, but I put one on the boat. I think. Yeah, I would put the orange one on the boat. You think so on the green? Yeah. I think that orange and green combo would look sick, but like a criminal logo. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Yeah. Yeah. We gotta go see how this thing looks on the boat. Yeah, you want to put it on? Yeah. All right. Yeah, right behind the fish finder. I think that's a good idea because I keep my paddle on the other side. Don't worry, Mr. Spider. What do you think? Like right here somewhere? I put my fish finder there. Yeah, I'm really right there. Super simple to install, just like every other Yak Attack product. I love how they make it so easy. Just like everything is just by hand. That's Yak Attack, that's Yak Attack. My paddle holder, my rotor grip Yak Attack. Everything. Okay. And then this just clicks in. Dude, that's firm too. Open them up while I'm on the boat. And I won't have any problem laying the fish because I can always, I always end up pulling them like up on top of this. So I'll never have any issues. And then if I do, I can move this back or something. I can rearrange it, but that's solid. That's not going anywhere. That's a good attachment. And you wouldn't even really, it's not going to get in my way at all. Because that's like so much unused space right here. That's perfect addition for the boat. She don't fit. Why is in a crusty screwdriver? Hope you guys enjoyed the video of that little unboxing. Um, I appreciate Connor for getting me that birthday gift and I hope you guys saw what it looked like. I think it's going to be an absolute game changer on the water. Um, but yeah, if you guys like this video and want to see more content like this, please leave a like, comment, subscribe for us and uh, we'll catch you in the next video.